Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Lamy, where I teach you how to be the best version of yourself. In order to do that, I need to be the best version of myself. And so I'm going to stop eating like so much red meat this year, 2021. Um, I don't really eat it that much anyway, so it's not a big deal. Um, but I need to incorporate other proteins in my diet. I feel like I'm not good about eating protein. Um, I eat more carbs and that's my problem. But uh, I want to do a product review for you guys today. I bought this Anna C. It's like a spicy poke bowl. Um, well, it's a spicy tuna that you can put in a poke bowl. And the other day I was at the mall and it was I ordered a poke bowl at the mall and it was so good. I couldn't stop thinking about it. So when I saw this at a local grocery store, I had to buy it. So this is what the package looks like. So inside of it, um, it has like, obviously it has your frozen tuna. Um, you can thaw it in the fridge overnight or you can thaw it in cold water for 30 minutes. So that's what I'm doing. And then it also comes with your seasoning that um, you can pour over the tuna. I'm super excited. I'm going to pair it with like some vegetables and some rice, you know, whatever, I, whatever I have in my fridge. But I wanted to show you what the packaging looks like. So this is what the packaging looks like in the back and the nutritional facts if you're interested. It's good because it, um, you know, I'm trying to eat lower carbs. So it's just one gram of carb if you eat half the pack versus the whole pack. It's two grams of carb. And then protein here, you know, 32 versus 64 for calories, 160 versus 3320. So that's not terrible. And then the ingredients, if you are interested to know about that, it does contain like soy um, and a couple nuts. So if you have allergies, you might want to stay clear of that. This is what the front looks like. Oh, it just looks so delicious. I cannot wait to eat this. I'm thawing it in the f um, cold water right now, and then I'll show you what I pair it with. So I'm going to show you my setup of my bowl. Um, so I have about... A cup of rice here and then I have uh, half a cucumber, uh, half an avocado, uh, half a cup of um, pickled radishes and then um, half a cup of shredded carrots and then some cilantro and then I just like um, put some rice seasoning on top and I bought this at Woodman's. It's just rice seasoning um, for when I want to eat sushi, but I don't want to roll, wrap it up or roll it up in seaweed or if I don't have it on hand. This stuff is great. I also use it to trick my son into eating rice because he doesn't always want to eat rice. Um, not that's a bad thing, but I don't want him to get full off protein only. So this is my setup. And then <clears throat> when the tuna is thawed, I will put that on top. So this is what the fish looks like. Um, I thawed it in cold water and actually it was faster to thaw than 30 minutes. I probably like, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes only to thaw. Um, and I did thaw it in cold water. It is um, frozen yellowfin tuna cubed up. I'm super excited to eat this. I'm so hungry. Um, so serving size, there's two per container and it's four ounces so I'll just eat half of it I usually try to keep my protein within three to four ounces each meal so the directions say thaw um, once thawed mix tuna sauce with a packet right into a bowl additioning top additional toppings and then mix and serve immediately so you can put some more toppings but I already have a lot of stuff in my bowl so here all I did was I emptied it into a container. I poured the sauce um, on top and then I'm going to mix it and I put it in a Tupperware because I know that I'm not going to eat the whole serving. I'll probably eat the rest of it for dinner. It's hard to mix with one hand. Oh, it smells so fresh. It doesn't smell fishy at all. Um, I did mix it already and then I'm just going to put it on top of my rice, about half of it, and I will eat the rest later. Oh, you guys, I'm so excited. Um, I am eating it raw. You're not supposed to cook it. This is a poke bowl. Um, and they freeze dry the fish, so it kills any parasites or worms that it may have. So um, in case you're worried about that, 
it's just it's so good it just melts in your mouth that's why i like to eat it like this oh my god i'm gonna be so full so here is my poke bowl i'm so excited to eat it it is so beautiful I'm going to try just the tuna because that is the review for today. Let's see if I like it, if I will buy more. Let's give it a try. Mmm. Mmm. That is so good. It's like refreshing. It just melts in your mouth. It's nice and cold. The seasoning is just right. It's not too spicy. It's got like a tint of um, sweetness and they even have like some, um, gosh, what the heck are those things called? <laughs> oh, sesame seeds. Mm, it is so good. Except for, I'm probably going to add some more like um, sriracha or something because I'd like it super spicy and it's just not spicy enough for me. That is the only thing. But this is so good. Two thumbs up so easy to prepare super easy i would give it five stars out of five i would definitely buy more of these i just can't remember how much i paid for them but i feel like they weren't that expensive they were definitely cheaper than the poke bowl that i bought at the mall so yes i would definitely recommend this and uh i'm gonna eat my lunch now because i'm starving we'll see you guys next time